hello viewers thanks for watching our videos if you not yet subscribe please subscribe so in this session we are going to discuss what is the answer for fifth one so they are given the adjoining pie chart gives the expenditure on various items during month for family then the number of written around pie charts tells the angle made by each sector at the center so they are given savings education rent food with the different angles so we have to find the answers for that so what they have given is angle of sector for savings is savings will be equal to 90 degrees then education will be 60 degrees then rent will be equal to 90 degrees then food will be equal to 120 degrees so what is the maximum here our first one is what is the maximum expenditure on which item expenditure is minimum so 60 degrees is minimum so on education which angle is less for that expenditure will be less our second one on which item is the expenditure is maximum so food so on food expenditure is maximum then our third question what is that is if the monthly income of the family is 9000 what is the expenditure on rent monthly income monthly income will be equal to 9000 rupees monthly income 9000 rupees this monthly income is divided for the remaining all the food rent education and savings and all so they are given indirectly total income will be equal to 9000 total income will be 9000 what is the expenditure on rent rent they are asked expenditure on rent let's take some x rupees so angle of sector formula angle of sector will be equal to expenditure angle of sector for rent will be equal to expenditure expenditure on rent divided by total income into 360 degrees so what is that is total income will be equal to 360 degrees then angle of sector will be equal to what is that 90 degrees will be equal to expenditure on rent will be let's take some x rupees total income will be 9000 and into 360 degrees so here what we need to do is just cancel 0 0 then we can take this as 3 1s are 3 2s are 3 3s are 9 double zeros then again 3 4s are 3 10s are 100 then x by 100 into 4 will be equal to 90 degrees then 2 2s are 2 5s are 10 then 2 1s are 2 2s are 2 5s are so x by 25 will be equal to 90 degrees so what is this is x by 25 will be equal to 90 then x will be equal to 90 into 25 so 0 so what is this is expenditure on rent will be equal to 200 2000s 250 rupees 2000 250 rupees so we are calculated expenditure on rent will be equal to 2000 220 rupees our next one what is our third one is so third one what is that is here expenditure on food will be equal to they are given expenditure expenditure on food 
expenditure of food will be equal to what is that is 3000 rupees then what is the expenditure on education of children expenditure on education we have to find what is that rupees so here two methods is there one you can calculate total income from the food again you can substitute in the education or directly you can compare the total incomes of total income will be equal total income in both equal so total income we can equate them so what is the total income formula total income equal to so we have to find so what is the formula of uh, expenditure on food so angle of sector angle of sector of will be food angle of sector for food 120 degrees expenditure by total for food into 360 that is 120 degrees expenditure on education and total education 360 total income total income will be equal to education 60 degrees so we are going to equate for both total will be equal to expenditure on food into 360 by 120 that is total income here also expenditure on education into 360 divided by 60 will be equal to total income total income total income both will be equal expenditure on food into 360 whole divided by equal to expenditure on education into 360 whole divided by 60 degrees then 360 360 will going to cancel expenditure on food they have given 3000 3000 by 120 expenditure on education we took it as x then x so we are going to calculate x will be equal to 3000 into 60 by 120 so this is the value 1 za 2 za so what is this 2 za then 2 1 za 2 2 5 za 10 then double zeros then expenditure on education will be 1000 expenditure on education will be 1500 so this is the one method so again you can calculate another method what is that method is so what is another method is so 3000 rupees expenditure on food will be 3000 rupees expenditure on education we have to find that is let's take x so what is the angle of sector so angle of sector angle of sector for food will be equal to expenditure on food will be total income into 360 so angle of sector for food we know what is that is 120 degrees expenditure on food will be 3000 then total income let's take ti into 360 degrees then what is this is total income will be equal to 3000 by 120 into 360 so here so 121 za 120 3 za then 3000 into 3 total income will be equal to 9000 rupees 9000 rupees then what we can calculate is here we can calculate angle of sector education will be let's take the angle of this one will be x by total income we got total income is 9000 into 360 then what is the angle of edu angle of sector for education will be equal to 60 degrees 60 degree will be equal to x by 9000 
into 360. Then what we can do x will be equal to 9000 into 60 by 360. 6 ones are 6. 60 is So 0 0 6 6 0 0 will cancelled to 0 0 then 6 ones are 6 66 are 360 then what we can do is 2 3s are 2 4 the 8 2 5 the double 0 then 4500 by 3 so that one will be equal to so here i am writing x will be 4500 by 3 3 ones are 3 3 5 are then x will be equal to 1500 rupees this method also you can solve thanks for watching please subscribe